Nicotine Stomatitis, Effects of Smoking on Oral Health Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, we will talk about nicotine stomatitis. According to the FDA, tobacco consumption remains the leading cause of preventable disease and death in the United States, with more than 480,000 deaths per year. A lit cigarette is a factory of chemicals, including nicotine, tar, arsenic, acetone, carbon monoxide, and many more. All these chemicals are completely harmful to health, not only for the person who consumes them, but also for those around them. Among the cigarette components, nicotine is the substance that generates addiction and can create as much dependence as heroin and cocaine. What is nicotine? It is a substance with stimulating properties that can produce pleasurable effects. It is present in the tobacco plant, although it can also be found in vegetables but in very small amounts. The consumption of nicotine causes a wide variety of side effects in most organs. The circulation can be affected in the following ways, increased tendency to coagulation, atherosclerosis, and enlargement of the aorta. In the brain, the effects include dizziness and confusion, irregular and altered sleep, and bad dreams and nightmares. In the gastrointestinal system, it produces nausea and vomiting and heartburn. The heart can experience a change in heart rate, an increase in blood pressure, and a higher risk of a heart attack. If a woman smokes during pregnancy, the baby may have risks in its development, such as obesity, high blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, respiratory difficulties, infertility, brain development problems, and behavioral problems. Nicotine stomatitis is a lesion in the palate mucosa that is caused by tobacco consumption. This lesion appears as white areas with raised red spots and a rough texture on the surface. Stomatitis can become more prominent as the smoking habit persists. What does nicotine stomatitis look like? The lesion appears as a gray or white blister, slightly raised. Brown or black spots can be observed on the teeth, which are the inflamed minor salivary glands. Stomatitis can present symptoms such as persistent bad breath, pain when chewing, sensitive red or inflamed gums, bleeding gums. Nicotine stomatitis is a benign pathology that can be prevented by quitting smoking. When quitting smoking, the symptoms disappear over time. Thank you very much for what you, you have explained. If you have any questions about this or other topics, you can contact us at Channel Island Family Dental as well as our Facebook page. We look forward to your visit and we will make a timely diagnosis. Our dentists in Oxnard, St. Paula, Venture, Newberry Park, and Port Hunane will be able